Hi friends, I am Balaji Rao. Welcome to BR Max class. In previous classes, we learned domain, range and graph of sine function and cosine function. In this class, we will learn domain, range and graph of tangent function. You observe here tan theta, tan theta. In this two things are there. One is theta, another one is tan theta. For respect to theta values, we will get tan theta values. For example, theta is 45 degrees. Tan theta is what? Tan 45 degrees is 1. So you can observe two things. One is 45 degrees, another one is 1. So here two things are there in this tan theta. Now we will see the general definition of domain and range of tan theta. You see here what values of theta the function tan theta is defined is called domain of this function please try to understand tan pi by 4 is defined yes so pi by 4 will be there in its domain tan pi by 3 is defined yes so pi by 3 will be there in its domain tan pi by 2 is defined pi by 2 tan pi by 2 as per the trigonometry table you know that tan pi by 2 is not defined so pi by 2 does not belong to its domain However, what is the general definition of domain of the function? For what values of theta the function tan theta is defined is called domain of this function. What is range? What values tan theta gives for respect to theta values? What values tan theta gives for respect to theta values? For example, theta equal to 45 degrees. Tan 45 degrees is 1. So 1 will be in the range of this function. Tan 60 degrees tan 60 degrees is root 3 root 3 will be in the range of this function now we will try to learn what is the domain of this function tan theta tan theta we know that tan theta can be written as sin theta divided by cos theta you see here in the denominator cos theta is there whenever cos theta is 0 then this total function is not defined that means whenever cos theta is 0 tan theta is not defined so here cos theta cannot be equal to 0 cos theta cannot be equal to 0 when cos theta is 0 whenever theta is odd multiple of pi by 2 uh, for example pi by 2 cos pi by 2 value 0 cos minus pi by 2 value 0 cos 3 pi by 2 value 0 cos of minus 3 pi by 2 value 0 cos of 5 pi by 2 value 0 cos of minus 5 by 2 value 0 so you can observe all these things 1 into pi by 2 3 into pi by 2 5 into pi by 2 whenever theta is odd multiple of pi by 2 whenever theta is odd multiple of pi by 2 cos theta will be 0 so whenever theta is 2n plus 1 into pi by 2 at that time cos theta will become 0 so here what you need to understand you need to understand that theta cannot be equal to odd multiple of pi by 2 theta cannot be equal to odd multiple of pi by 2 why if theta equal to odd multiple of pi by 2 cos theta value will become 0 so here cos theta is becoming 0 means tan theta is not defined so theta cannot be equal to odd multiple of pi by 2 so what is the domain of this function domain domain this tan function is defined for all real numbers no tan function is defined for all real numbers except the numbers which are odd multiple of pi by 2 2 n plus 1 into pi by 2 what is n here n is an integer in place of n if you write integer you will get all these values so what is the domain of tan theta all real numbers except odd multiple of pi by 2 now we will try to learn what is the range of tan theta. Range of tan theta. We know that tan theta is defined as y by x. This we got from the definition of tan theta. You can observe this. This we learned in the beginning of uh, definitions of trigonometric ratios. Tan theta is y by x. What is y here? y is any real number. right? What is x here? x is also a real number which is not equal to 0. Because when x is 0, uh, this function is not defined that means tan theta is not defined y is real number x is a real number and x is not equal to 0 what you will say about y by x y by x also will be a real number 
right what is y by x y by x is tan theta so tan theta is what tan theta is real numbers so what values the tan theta gives that is known as range of that function what values tan theta gives tan theta can give any real number tan theta can give any real number so what is the range of this tan theta range of tan theta is all real numbers what is the domain of tan theta all real numbers except odd multiple of pi by 2 what is the range of tan theta all real numbers now we will try to learn the graph of tan function you observe here i consider some theta values 0 degrees pi by 2 pi 3 pi by 2 2 pi minus pi by 2 minus pi minus 3 pi by 2 minus 2 pi from the trigonometry table we know all these values tan 0 degrees value tan 0 degrees value is 0 tan pi by 2 we know that whenever theta is odd multiple of pi by 2 1 into pi by 2 at the time tan theta is not defined tan pi by 2 is not defined tan pi value tan pi value is 0 all these things we learn in trigonometry table trigonometry table we learn trigonometry values from 0 to 360 degrees see here odd multiple of pi by 2 3 into pi by 2 whenever theta is odd multiple of pi by 2 tan theta is not defined so this is not defined tan 2 pi tan 2 pi value is 0 now tan of minus pi by 2 we know that tan of minus pi by 2 is minus tan pi by 2 minus tan pi by 2 what is tan pi by 2 value tan pi by 2 value is infinity so tan of minus pi by 2 is minus infinity tan of minus pi is minus 0 minus 0 is nothing but 0 only tan of minus 3 pi by 2 tan of minus 3 pi by 2 is minus tan 3 pi by 2 tan 3 pi by 2 value 0 so tan of minus 3 pi by 2 is minus infinity tan of minus 2 pi is minus tan 2 pi minus tan 2 pi is 0 minus 0 is nothing but 0 only now i'll mark all these points on the graph to get the tan graph you please observe this graph in this graph there are vertical lines you please observe in this graph we can identify these vertical lines where i draw on this vertical lines whenever odd multiple of pi by 2 is there odd multiple if pi by 2 is there you see here this is a theta is pi by 2 at this point i drawn vertical line why because at this point theta equal to pi by 2 tan theta is not defined again at 3 pi by 2 i drawn vertical line why because tan 3 pi by 2 is not defined similarly tan of minus pi by 2 is not defined where tan theta is not defined there i drawn one vertical line after drawing vertical lines you try to mark these points 0 comma 0 here 0 comma 0 is there next point is pi by 2 comma plus infinity this is pi by 2 plus infinity infinity means not defined so you observe here infinity is will be here here pi by 2 comma infinity will be here and if you take pi by 4 tan pi by 4 value tan pi by 4 value is 1 tan 60 degrees value tan 60 degrees value root 3 1.74 something like that if you mark all those points you will will mark all those points will mark all those points right now you see here uh, tan pi value tan pi value is 0 tan 3 pi by 2 value 3 pi by 2 value is infinity 3 pi by 2 comma infinity point will be here now 2 pi 2 pi is 0 similarly you mark other things also here you have to observe one thing 0 to pi by 2 0 to pi by 2 uh, means tan theta is positive tan theta is positive means positive y axis you as marked points are there you join all of them you will get the graph like this please try to understand you will get you will get graph like this right okay now pi by 2 to pi pi by 2 to pi is second quadrant in second quadrant tan theta is negative in second quadrant tan theta is negative so then uh, negative means negative y axis then the graph starts in the here pi by 2 pi by 2 to pi second quadrant tan theta values are negative then the graph comes like this like this okay pi by 2 to 3 pi by 2 pi by 2 to 3 pi by 2 is in third quadrant we know that in third quadrant tan is positive that's why these are the positive y values we are getting here please try to understand okay now 3 pi by 2 to 2 pi 3 pi by 2 to 2 pi is in fourth quadrant in fourth quadrant tan theta is negative 
so it starts from here similarly you can identify these points and you can draw the graph of tan function it is important in plus one plus two level it is important to remember the graph of tangent function it is not like that every time we will mark all x values y values and we will join them and we will get the graph it is important you need to remember how what how the graph of tan x will be whenever you remember the graph of tan x function immediate thing is first vertical lines where the vertical lines we will draw where the tan function is not defined there we will draw the vertical lines and we know that tan pi value tan 2 pi value tan minus pi value tan minus 2 pi values is 0 and the graph will be like this you need to memorize these things it is important because uh, the importance of this graph is uh, very high while doing object to bits in trigonometry so finally what we learn in this class we learn domain of tan theta what is domain of tan theta all real numbers except odd multiple of pi by 2 what is the range of tan theta range of tan theta is all real numbers you can observe here uh, tan theta gives all the real values tan theta will gives you all the real values so range of tan theta is all real numbers and the graph looks like this <laughs>